And so we've spent the last couple of weeks trying to survey the area using the ground penetrating radar and trying to find a way through the crevasse field. There's a crevasse here within 10 meters of our container, of our house. Now this opened up when we dropped one of our fuel scoots over. Um, it's not majorly wide, it's only about one to two meters wide, but it's a deep one. It must go down probably 10, 20 meters down there. Um, so what we do is we use the cat to build a nice big ramp over the top and it creates an arch over the top of the, uh, you see Spence there, building the ramp. It creates an arch over the top and uh, actually strengthens, makes it a massive snow bridge and helps strengthen. And in doing this, it creates, you know, a safe platform for us to tow all our gear over the top. So even though there's a big hole here, we can uh, tow all our gear up and over the caboose, up and over the ramp, so over the caboose. So, uh, yeah, as you can see, we're in quite a precarious situation at the moment. Well, we finally managed to move camp. Now it's uh, not very far, you know, we've, we've moved probably half a kilometre, 500 metres. Um, but at least we've managed to move. We've been stuck in the same position for, well, for, for nearly 20 days, I think it's been. Uh,